so we create print writer demo print writer this is just show you how to write to file so name an instance okay file writer equals to new print writer <coughs> and the same thing you just need to specify the file that you want to write to right so let's check the constructor a little bit is it it needs string right so <coughs> it's not a file then just a string <coughs> so the file name is write.txt I'm going to name like that so you don't really need to invoke the file class at all just provide a file name import the print writer from java.io and this is the same when you write to file you need to do handle by surrounding by try catch right <coughs> and again we don't want to do though because we want to handle it if you do though that means you let the method that invoke right just to handle it <coughs> so we're going to write a message that there is a problem to write to the file <coughs> so that's it we just need to write something now dot write right dot print right just like system dot out right print line that means you want to print with the new line test <coughs> I'm gonna say write test let's run the program <coughs> <coughs> now we refresh hit F5 on Eclipse mm, right or uh, right click and refresh There you go. You see that the file is written name write txt because we make the file to write to this. Let me write open that write dot txt. <coughs> All right. So <coughs> now there's a problem here. Remember, you need to close the file, right? Every time when you deal with this, you need to close. Okay. Otherwise, you see the text not coming yet. <coughs> let's run the game there you go we just wrote the text to a file <coughs> so very simple right let's review again instantiate an object of the print writer and the rest is like you use system.out replace that with the instance name and pass the, the constructor for print writer you need to pass in the file name you can also do the absolute path if you don't want it to write to this location <coughs> so if you want to do that it's going to write in the same location with your class file which is in the project folder in that case you want to refresh this okay right click and refresh after you run the program you see a file open show up and then open the file to check the contents <coughs> now for for your assignment you pretty much just already have your cycle right you just going to copy your class here and do the two string version of that right like if I create new class if I want to write the contents of my class name cycle so create a class cycle with the attributes right so this is just an example so I'm going to just create two attributes like wage like double wage <coughs> double wheel right wheels <coughs> and then you going to do the constructor 
getter setters Do the two string. Now I'm going to just do the two string. Since we have two string here, that means when I instantiate the object on my print writer, <coughs> so I'm going to say cycle a cycle equals to new <coughs> cycle pass in the wage and number of builds that doubles now when you want to write instead of write text I can just say write to file right we we'll just called it a cycle let's go call it a two string <coughs> and that should do so run it now open there you go we just write the number of builds and which right to the file <coughs> and that that's it for assignment and I pretty much just show you that now I'm going to create the git okay and po post this in that loop So name a seven <coughs> cycle output right. <coughs> so that's the cycle file output. So this is to demonstrate how to write text to a text file in Java using print writer <coughs> only print writer class right <coughs> and I guess there's no reason for you to get zero score on these two assignments because the answer is there 